Welcome into the Pippins postgame show brought to you by Cascade Natural Gas. It's a series win for the Pippins as they take down the Ridgefield Raptors for the second straight game, this time by an 8-3 score thanks to a solid start from Julian Towden Chabot. The Pippins started from behind for the third straight game against Ridgefield, who scored two runs off of Towden Chabot in the second, but the right-hander would lock right back in, retiring nine in a row and setting up opportunities for the Pippins' bats to get hot they would chase the starter after three innings and 10 hits. They would play one in the bottom of the second, four in the bottom of the third, and two more in the fourth, and end up running away with it. Eight to three, the final. Julian Town Jabot finished with six innings of one hit baseball en route to the eight to three win, and he is our Cascade Natural Gas High Efficiency Player of the Game. His interview coming up next on the Pippins Post Game Show. Be an energy efficiency hero. Install high efficiency natural gas equipment and you can be just like Cascade's most energy efficient player of the game. Match his ERA of $678. Put some runs on the board by upgrading your furnace, improving your home's insulation, and switching to a condensing tankless water heater. Cascade's bench is deep with both residential and commercial incentives. Check them out at our website or give us a call and be an energy efficiency player of the game. Welcome into the Pippins Post Game Show, brought to you by Cascade Natural Gas. We're here with our high efficiency player of the game, Julian Towden Chabot. After the solid start today, six solid innings from you, only allowing the one hit and a solid effort and a big win for the Pippins. How much does this series win mean to the team, and what's the vibe in the locker room right now? Um, it's really great to get the series win, uh, especially starting off the second half hot. So uh, yeah, felt great. Yeah, back to 500 on the second half, three and three to open up half number two of the season. And I think this is the first time we've had you up here this season, but first start in both years in a Pippins uniform, and it was one of your best efforts today. So what was going right out there on the mound in the win? Um, really just making small adjustments. Uh, got a few too many walks in the second there, gave up a few runs, but uh, just kind of came back and um, made some adjustments that uh, helped me out in the end. Yeah, after those walks, you had nine straight batters retired. When you start seeing – the pitches go in like that, and you start seeing the defense back you up a little bit. Does that help you on the mound and uh, yeah. help the energy throughout the rest of the way? Yeah, definitely, and uh, the run support, too, is great. Um, guys hit it around a lot, so uh, it's fun to watch, and it's fun to have as a pitcher, for sure. Yeah, and, and we eight, eight to three the victory today, but the Pippins, it seemed like for the majority of the game they were up by 10 runs with the amount of hits early on, finishing with 12 hits in this game, and when you see the offense clicking on all cylinders like that, it certainly helps you out on the mound. Yeah, definitely. Uh, yeah, it was just fun to fun to be a part of. Uh, it felt like we had the momentum all game and uh, had a lot of good energy today. So, yeah, it was a good win. Yeah, big series win. What momentum are you looking to take into Kamloops tomorrow? Um, well, we got a little chippy last series, but uh, just playing our game, playing the same way we did this series. Yeah, trying to win back-to-back -back series and get back to a hot start here in the second half. So that's our high-efficiency player of the game. Thanks, Julian. Thank you. That wraps up the Pippins Postgame Show brought to you by Cascade Natural Gas.